This is the day that the Lord has made and I will rejoice and be glad on today. But on this day, I'm, I'm finna to be tired. I'm tired with these folks out here in these streets. It is Christmas season and it's a whole new breed of folk out here Christmas shopping, y'all. Let me just tell y'all, I go to the store. I try to get there bright and early before folks wake up. I'm at the crack of dawn. I'm clocking with the employees at the actual store. But you know what? One store, I took my time. I was behind the ball. I was. I got distracted. So as I'm in the store, I'm filling up my cart with different items I'm finding for on my actual list for my family for gifts. I got to stop because someone's looking at my cart to figure out, where did you get that from? Do they have any more? So now I'm acting like the employee that work at the store showing them where I got the product from. What? And then they rude and they got their mama, their daddy, their uncle, the niece, nephew, and almost the little dog carry on in the cart. It's just so many people and I, I, I'm not a crowd person. I am a people person, but in what, when it comes to crowds, y'all, I just can't take all them folk. It's just folk. I can't. But I'm still excited. I'm still happy. I'm still grateful. And I'm still thankful to be alive during this time in the season in my life. Christmas is here, guys. Christmas is nearly days away. Are you excited? Some of the traditions that we are doing this year in the royal household, I asked my husband, I said, sweetie, what do you want to do this year as a tradition for the household? His idea was to have a Christmas themed pajama party. Yes, a Christmas themed pajama party. So I've invited all my friends and my family over because we'll be hosting our first Christmas Eve pajama party as husband and wife. And I cannot wait to see the pajamas when they walk through that door. I cannot wait to eat. I can't wait to cook. I can't wait to laugh and be merry amongst my loved ones, you guys. I'm going to try to vlog for you. Let me not even say that. Let me back that up. Hopefully I can pick up the camera and capture some footage for you guys so I can have some more content. For you guys around this whole Christmas uh, theme that's going on this year within the household for the pajama party. You guys, please stay tuned because I definitely pick up the camera and vlog some content for you guys. But other than that, I've just been in the house, you know, just trying to decorate. I did have a video posted up about decorating the house. I didn't do too much decorating. I did enough, if that makes sense. Um, cause y'all know I'm the queen of returning stuff. If it don't work in my space, I'm taking it on back to that stove. Cause you know, I still need to count my coins and stay in budget. So as of today, I should be on target. I might have to run out and do a couple more items as far as food preparations, but other than that, it should be fine. Um, I did really good on budget as far as spending because I did have my notebook. I wrote things down so I can stay on task when I go to each individual store. But with that being said, you guys, Christmas is here. As you can see, I'm in my living room. I'm sitting on the step because I'm finna be tired. I picked up something to eat for me and Sweetie when he comes home from work. So I'm just going to eat and just chill out and maybe catch a movie and just get ready for the next day. So I did pick up some items to host this year for our first Christmas pajama party. I'm going to show you some items that I picked up from our local Walmart. I cannot wait to share with you the items that I have to bring in the celebrations of Christmas this year. Okay, guys, let's go downstairs to see. Wait a minute. I'm just I'm laughing because this lamp, y'all, is like, this lamp has just been in the house, just in the house. It has no home. It's just, I'm moving from place to place. It's just in the house. So, wait, I wanted to show you guys really quickly on the screen, which I never really show, um, the house during the daytime for some reason. But can you see that, guys? I just typed in... Winter Wonderland on YouTube, and it's very merry and bright and white Christmassy themes shown on the screen. It looks so good. And then we have the fireplace going. A fireplace is always going in the house. I need to fix that egg because it's looking a little crooked eye, crooked eye letter. Yeah, so it's nice and toasty. The smell. And the home is very warm and cozy. Y'all know I always like to set a vibe in my home. It's cozy. It's nothing. It's buttery. It's giving a uh, very cinnamon. Um, it's just very warm and cozy in here. And I just love, I can't wait to come home. I love being home. Don't ask me to go nowhere because I'm I ain't coming. I ain't coming. I want to be home. 
home. I want to be home. Oh, here you go. She's so cute. Look at her. She's cute. She is, she's giving. She really understood the assignment. She's so cute. She's standing so tall. Now, this is a slim pine tree. She's so cute. And I'm waiting for my husband to actually come home from work today because my uh, angel at the top, for some reason, I can't um, connect it to the outlet because the actual cord on the back is too short so i'm gonna have to get an extension cord just to make that a little bit longer so that can be connected and lit up as well in between time in the meantime let's go down these stairs so i can show you guys the items i got from earlier at the local walmart okay you guys seen that little setup oh wait 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 so let me show you guys the storage for all the christmas stuff it's the light y'all i feel so bad about this garage like this garage is not really for storage right now it's based upon his actual setup for his home gym and i feel really bad because my husband can't even get in here to work out at night y'all it's looking like a whole warehouse but these are gifts that i sought out for my family and my friends and i just been dropping stuff off in here I'm going to take my time and go through each gift so I can have it all gifted and wrapped and put where it needs to go. This is some Thanksgiving stuff I need to actually go through, y'all. It's giving very much just a lot going on in here, so I'm going to have to get that together. I really do feel really bad with him not being able to, let me just cut the light on, with him not being able to actually work out because he really works hard in that space. And I don't want to take that away from him too much longer. But then again, he has to understand that it's Christmas, child. And this is what it's going to be. The house is going to be full to capacity as far as Christmas items that goes on this house. Because one thing about me that my mom and my grandmother and my family in general has always taught me is to be grateful for what you have. Always give what you have to others. And, you know, just be married during the holidays. The holidays is from, something for me is always about family and just being grateful for having family. You know, in the world we live in today, there's a lot going on. So whatever you have as far as a loved one, it could be a dog, a cat, a fish. Just love on that with all you got, your family. Just love on each other, guys. This is the time where we need to just love on each other and just be there for each other. Okay, so enough rambling. Let me just show you all some of these goodies I got. How cute is this Coco Cone? Coco cone hot chocolate super cute and then i found these cherry cotton candy um cotton candy cherry like so cute i found some hershey kisses some more christmas themed items here along with some holiday shortbread cookies now this is going to be for the christmas eve party you guys it's going to be so it's going to be pretty much a bunch of snacks i did find some pajamas here that I'm going to um, have for me. My husband will have matching pajama sets. I do have some peppermint candy canes, the cherry candy canes, and just some more, um, you know, small plates. I found some necklaces here for uh, my nieces and my goddaughters. Oh, um, this is the candy jewelry, actually. And then some more napkins, more of the cotton candy. And then I had this good old, you know what? You know when you just grandma house and you was like, where the Christmas cookies at? How cute is the smaller version of the bigger version of the Christmas shortbread cookies? So cute. This is super upside down. I apologize. So cute. So I got a few of these to give out as well as some more of the um, gourmet trio popcorn. I'm going to be just crunching and munching and chewing and just, and just enjoying my little self, okay? I did find a gingerbread kit. This is a row home, a row house gingerbread kit. Um, I found this at our local Target. Y'all know I love Target. I haven't been to Target as much, but this is a go-to as far as some of the Christmas items I did get from Target this year. Did get there in the garage. I don't want to show them because I have to sit down and really go through each item. Um, yeah, so that was a couple of items I did get from Target as well as our local Walmart, you guys. I am just such in a good spirit this year for Christmas because it's very special. It's very dear to my heart to just celebrate just the season of Jesus Christ. Um, I just can't wait to just be around loved ones, you guys. I just cannot wait. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. 
won't you guys do me a favor and first actually like this channel make sure you don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel as well as leave in the comments below what are the some of the traditions you guys do for your family during christmas time do you get together christmas eve christmas day do you guys make favorite dishes do you opt out for those who really shouldn't cook a dish but still bring a dish <laughs> and you still gotta sit there and act like it's good well luckily in my family we all enjoy cooking so that won't really be an issue um, yeah, so I'm, I'm really excited. I cannot wait. I promise I will try to pick up and show some content for you guys of how our first Christmas pajama party goes this year. In the meantime, I'll catch you guys in the next vlog. As always, you guys be safe.